Here's your weather on the threes. Temperatures running in the 70s across Acadiana, 71 in Jennings. You've got Lafayette at 73, 72 for New Iberia with Phil Platt coming in right around 68 degrees. Natchez, Alexandria, both at 67. A lot of clouds working their way across the area here this morning. Still dealing with some, some mugginess, some moisture that's lingering out there. A front's coming through and it will interact with that moisture a bit, enough to kind of spark up a few spotty showers by the afternoon. A lot of that I think going to take place along and south of the I-10 corridor with the drier air sitting just to our, towards our west and our north. And that filters in as we get a little further into the afternoon and the evening. We'll be much, much drier tomorrow, It'll be much, much cooler tomorrow. 73 now should be in the 60s tomorrow morning. A little bit of cloud cover out there with winds from the north northwest at five miles an hour. Dew point still sitting at about 70. It's been an incredibly muggy run of weather going all the way back to last week. We had all the showers. We had all that moisture and dealing with a little bit of that out there again today. Again, you're still talking partly sunny skies, isolated showers. It's warm. It's muggy out there. Highs up at about 86, but tonight it gets much drier and it cools off a decent amount too as well. We'll get down to about 65 talking mostly clear skies headed into tomorrow and should stay very quiet all the way through the rest of this week and getting on into the weekend. These temperatures will sit in the lower 80s through the rest of this week as well. And a big part of that is just going to be the drier air that gets into the area. Let's pause this tomorrow afternoon. You can see deep dry air out over in Texas and creeping on into our neck of the woods. Now we're right kind of on the boundary of where that moisture is going to lie. So it's going to be a little more unsettled out over towards the east. Look for showers to keep going to our east, but getting drier through the middle of the week and staying quiet all the way through. This takes us on to Friday. And even beyond that, getting on into the weekend should continue to see dry air. So that's why the forecast is going to settle down like that and end up being so quiet. It will be a nice break. It was very unsettled last week. It wasn't the nicest weekend, but we should make up for that with this stretch weather. Again, your high today gets up to about 86 degrees. 65 for that overnight low. We'll go with a 30% chance of showers with improving weather through tomorrow and Wednesday. And even beyond that, we're looking pretty good for the extended forecast.